All right, good evening everyone. Tonight we are going to do a brief training on how to mask your website. So the first thing I typically do is I go to Google and I type in cheap domain and this typically gives me an option for GoDaddy. I like to use GoDaddy over most of them because it gives you a shorter time to wait to get your website name linked to your actual website. So typically it is the third option right here and you'll see that it's 99 cents with tax it end up being a dollar and 17 cents okay so we'll go ahead and click on that and then it'll take us to GoDaddy and what you'll want to do is you'll just type in whatever domain name that you want to use so you will see here at the start your domain search here and you can just type in um, for an example, we'll say maybe okay. And so to see if that's available, we'll click on go. And for this, it is saying that it is available. So we would then scroll down here. You don't really want to mess with anything over here. And we'll just click continue to cart. Now, I'm not actually going to buy this. I'm just doing this so that you'll know what to do. So here it'll say terms, and I typically move it to two years, but paying $9.34 for two years isn't bad. Or oh, I accidentally said I changed it to two years. It already is set for two years, but I changed it for one year. But like I was saying, paying $9.34 for two years really isn't a bad deal. But if you only want to pay 117, what you'll do is you'll change that to one year. Your total here will be a dollar seventeen. And you can see over here that's your checkout. For your order total is 117. And you'll just put press continue to check out. And because I haven't logged in yet, um, it's telling me that I need to either log in or create an account. I already have an account. Um, so I don't need to create anything, but if you are new to GoDaddy, then you will need to create an account. So what I am going to do, however, is now I'm going to log into a name that I already have so that I can show you all how to do it with something that I already have. Alright, so now I'm logging in here and I'm going to go. Now pay attention to this part. So after you've got your domain name, what you're going to do is go to all products, and then you're going to go to domain, and you're going to come down here to where it says management and domain management. You're going to click on domain management. And you can see that I have a bunch of different uh, domain names already in place. So what I am now going to do is go to CamilleIco.com. And you so whatever domain name you want to use, that's what you'll click on, just like what I just did. And then here under domain information, you'll see forwarding. And then manage right next to it. What you want to do is click on manage. And then it'll say forward CamilleEichel.com to, and right here you're going to put in whatever website you want to forward your domain to or mask your domain. So, for instance, if I wanted this to go to, let's say I have a website called Get Weekly Paycheck. Dot com backslash get money Friday. Okay. So I'll type that in there and I can you can click preview to see what website that's actually going to pop up to. So as that generates, I'm also going to click on advanced options. And if you just want to forward something, then you can just click OK. If you want to actually map something, what you're going to do is go down here 
you'll hit the advanced options like I just did, and then you'll hit forward with masking. And then you'll just type in a name here, and I'll just put in uh, make money with skill. And then you can put in this a short description of your website and keywords so that people can find it easier. And then you will click OK. So you can see this is my website here that people will then see. So the dom name name that I just saw or just saw is CamilleIco.com. All right. And that's going to be forwarded to getweeklypaychecks.com backslash get money Friday. And here's the website right there. But I not only want to forward it, but I want to mask it. So if I just forward it, if someone types in CamilleIco.com, then in the browser, the Get Weekly Paychecks would still pop up. But when you mask it, even though you're forwarding it, it will come up as CamilleIco.com. So hopefully that's clear. It's not to me a message or nothing explain that further for you. So you just click OK and typically it takes about 15 to 20 minutes for it to link sometime sooner than that. It just really depends. So hopefully you all now know how to forward and map your website with a domain name. Good luck to you and let me know if you have any questions. Talk to you later. Bye.